And looks like they got their weapon working. Red Square is ready. We have a fight on our hands. Here we go. Three, two, one. Fight! My name is Zachary Vital. I'm a uh, five-time RoboGame champion, and we are here at the best place in the world, the World Robotics Tournament RoboGames. We have 29 countries represented this year. They've, people have come from all around the world. Uh, there's so many new faces, it's really inspiring to see. And uh, we are fighting robots, competing against one another. Robots are walking and doing races. We have giant combat robots tearing each other apart. There are uh, whole androids that are doing kung fu contests, and it's, it's amazing. There's nothing else like it in the world. Uh, this is, I, I love the joke they did for the t-shirt this year. It goes up to 11, which is a bad Spinal Tap reference, because the amp goes to 11. So this is RoboGames number 11. Um, this is the 12th year. Last year they didn't hold it, and the community was very sad but Dave Calkins managed to get the funding back together and put this back together from, basically resurrect it from the grave. And I am so happy to be back. This is the first year RoboGames has had all 30 spots in the heavyweight division filled. They have 30 120 pound robots and the, they're actually wondering how they're gonna get through all these matches because so many robots have shown up this year. And it, it's, it's just amazing how the community's come together since RoboGames came back. Well, I think everyone realized it once it was gone that their chance to fight big robots, it, it was completely just disappeared. No one else can afford to set this huge arena up or pay the insurance to put a crowd around it. And even when BattleBots announced they were coming back, it's invitation only. And so you won't have the garage builders come out of nowhere anymore. You have to get an invite. So this is only gonna go to like competitors and someone who knows somebody. And so RoboGames is the last open source contest where you're gonna see a, a kid and his dad building something in their garage or just an, a, an eccentric designer come up with this groundbreaking design. I feel that's the real spirit of the sport. It's not, I'm gonna go pick someone who can build a good robot. It's, Let's see what people can make. I hope to see RoboGames continue to expand. I hope David Calkins gets a TV show on the Discovery Channel with this. He actually has Grant Imahara coming tomorrow to host the matches and narrate the whole thing. And I, I hope this will continue to grow with the actually being allowed to have builders come out of, come out of the woodwork and compete. I mean, just listen to that. <laughs>